without putting on a uniform Smart when nuts and rode a unicorn through the storm Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again bringing you guys another Madden 16 Ultimate Team Pack opening video. Guys, today there are brand new honors cards in the game. We have a JJ Watt and an Anquan Bolden honors card. Obviously, JJ Watt, Defensive Player of the Year. Anquan Bolden, Walter Payton, Man of the Year. So uh, both of these guys got really, really nice cards today. Both of these cards are going for a good amount. I think Anquan Bolden, the last time I checked, was going for about 450 to 480,000 coins, somewhere in that range, uh, depending on the time that you look and I think JJ Watt was up at like 750 800,000 coins so two very very nice things that we could potentially pull in packs today uh, and if you guys don't remember from last year's game at least from Madden 15 the, the honors cards were actually some of the best cards later in the game even. I mean, it took months and months and months before we started to get some really ridiculous stuff that was actually better than the honors cards. So, uh, I think this is a good time to pull some packs, guys. So, what we're going to do today is we're going to go in here and we're going to just start ripping packs, man. Um, we've got, let's see here, you know, we've got, what... 7,075,000 coins or something like that. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to keep ripping packs until we get down to just under 7 million, um, which should be, I think, 10 packs for us. Uh, and then, so 10 pro packs, of course. And then, you know what? Depending on how things go, we might need to pull a game changer pack as well. If we don't pull any of the ridiculous stuff, we might have to pull a game changer pack because we can do one of those with coins. They are 100,000 coins, which is very expensive. Typically, guys, I do not recommend doing this, but for the sake of the video, I think we might go ahead and do it. The game changer bundles are also in the game, guys. You can either do a two game changer pack bundle, which will give you a Super Bowl item, of course, or a four Super Bowl items, excuse me, or you can do the eight game changer pack bundle, which is 8,000 points, very, very expensive, but you do get a Super Bowl legend. Now that those are a little bit less expensive, maybe not quite as good as it was a couple of days ago when they had the Super Bowl bundle in the game, but... I don't know. You guys will have to let me know in the comment section below. I know typically, um, like I said, guys, the, the bundles are very rarely worth it, if you put it that way. But, you know, if you're trying to get some elite cards, um, you know, when I say elite, I mean like top line guys, not just the, the red cards. Um, this is the way to do it. You kind of have to open up the bundles on unfortunately typically but um like i said guys we're gonna try our best here actually the best thing that i've had luck with this year is opening up I and mean, in previous years too is just open up pro packs so we're gonna go like i said go through and actually just open up some pro packs hopefully we can get some good luck today and hopefully you guys will enjoy this pack opening video if you are enjoying it do me a favor guys look at this bs by the way what is this i don't even want this 100 coin quick sell like, can I just get rid of this damn thing, seriously? But anyways, <laughs> if you guys are enjoying this video at any time, do me a favor, click that like button. And of course, guys, subscribe to the channel if you're new. So let's continue, guys. We didn't get anything out of this one. Other than that, fire 100 coin quick sell. <laughs> I don't even know, like I said, guys, why they... Uh, and I've said this in many, many videos. I don't know why the hell they include those 100 coin quick sells. Like, it's so stupid in my opinion. It, it doesn't help anybody. Like, who is that helping? I would literally rather have a bronze badge. Like, or, or, you know, like a coach. I would rather have anything than that. I mean, seriously, it's just taking up one of my spots. Like, what are you doing? Why are you being such dicks? Why do you got to give us such BS out of these packs, man? That's such, like, a bad thing to pull. Clinton McDonald, nothing out of the packs so far. We're still holding out, holding out hope, though, that we can get something good here. We still got, a, you know, at least a, a handful more of packs. But let me know, guys. Have you guys been pulling any, any of these honors cards? I haven't seen a whole lot of people posting them and tweeting them at me. Um, a few people have, so I know some people are pulling them, but not as many as usual. Like, usually when they do the 24-hour cards and stuff like that, usually there's at least, you know, like a handful of people that tweet them at me. I think, like, maybe, like, two people or something tweeted the honors cards at me, and we get a Justin Gilbert. Damn it. Um, but, yeah, like I said, I, I haven't really seen a whole lot of them, so I don't know if these are more rare than usual or what, but... I don't know. Like I said, the, the honors cards are usually pretty damn good, so it wouldn't surprise me. And that Anquan Bolden, by the way, guys, one of the better blocking cards in the game. If you're looking for a blocking wide receiver, it's very, very similar to the Heinz Ward re that recently came out. That Heinz Ward is really, really good. So if you're looking for somebody potentially to uh, block on a sweep or something like that to the outside, or even if you want to be extra dirty and put him at tight end, that Anquan Bolden's not a bad option. I think his price might continue to drop a little bit. So um, as he gets down there in price, it might not be a bad option to go out there and, and uh, acquire him. And we get an Andy Lee punter card there, a gold one. So 
Um, yeah, I mean, we're down here, what, three more pro packs right now? Not looking too good right now, but uh, we're still going to probably pull that game changer, though. Unless we pull something really ridiculous, then I'm not going to push my luck. We pull one of the re really rare things that we can get in the game right now. If we get, like, one of the elite team of the weeks or, um, or we get an honors card or something like that out of these pro packs, we're not going to pull the game changer. But if we don't, we got to pull the game changer, you know? So, again, guys, yeah, definitely uh, Anquan Bolden. Pretty damn beastly card. JJ, watch the, the fire one, of course, if you can get that. And we're, so for some reason, missing card art on some of these. I don't know why it does that every once in a while. Antrell roll. So we're down here to our final pro pack of this pack opening video, guys. So uh, wish me luck here. It looks like we're probably going to be pulling this game changer, which should be pretty exciting. Because, uh, yeah, we haven't really had great luck. We get a Seaver. How do you even pronounce this dude's name? Silver Saliga. That's right. Okay. I think that's, I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it, pronounce it, but don't get anything out of these packs at all. We're just barely in still the one, the 7 million coin mark, so uh, we're going to have to fall below that, guys. We got to pull this freaking game changer pack, so here it is, guys. Beautiful, brand new, brand spanking new game changer pack. <laughs> Hopefully, we can get something good. Ray Lewis on the cover. Oh, man. I hate pulling packs that are this expensive, but you know what? It's... You only live once, right? It's one of those type of situations. Let's do it. Hopefully, we get something good out of this. Give me one elite in this pack at least. Come on. Give me something. Let's go. Terrell Brown, Brandon Myers, RG3, only golds, and we get our first elite. It's an elite badge. Okay. Like, could be worse, I guess. Could be worse. Michael Crabtree, Corey Graham, come on. And we get, are you kidding me? This isn't a game changer pack, EA. A game changer pack. We get absolutely shit on. We get nothing good. Wow. The only thing of value we got out of this game changer pack, I'm pretty sure, unless I'm completely forgetting something, is this elite badge. That really sucks. That is unfortunate, but hopefully you guys had better luck than I did. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Like I said, guys, good luck pulling your own honors cards. I really hope that you guys pull them. If you do, feel free to tweet them at me. I might retweet one or two. So, uh, again, guys, thank you so much for all the support. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor. Click that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys again soon. Hey guys, if you're enjoying my videos, do me a favor, click that subscribe button on the right side of your screen right now. Otherwise, you can always check out my previous video by clicking on the left side of the screen. Thank you guys again.